Hi, I'm Frank, and in this video, we will look at a simple method for viewing voltage and current across a device under test, abbreviated DUT, using an oscilloscope and a waveform generator. A waveform is generated across the DUT that is placed in series with a shunt resistor. The oscilloscope is set to XY mode, and the X axis displays the approximate voltage across the DUT. This assumes voltage across the sense resistor is minimal. Current is displayed on the y-axis as measured across the shunt resistor. Here, the oscilloscope is in normal mode. The waveform generator is producing a 3-volt peak-to-peak triangle wave centered about ground as a function of time, as shown by the yellow trace. The green trace shows the voltage across the shunt resistor. It measures zero since it is unconnected to a DUT and the circuit is open. Setting the oscilloscope to XY mode results in a horizontal line since only the voltage is varying. Keep in mind that voltage is on the X axis and current is on the Y axis. Let's test a resistor. Current increases in direct proportion to the voltage, with resistance shown by the slope of the line, a demonstration of Ohm's law. Next in line is a 1N4148 silicon switching signal diode. We see the typical diode behavior with the diode switching on around 0.6 volts. When a red LED is tested, the diode turns on at about 1.6 volts. Now let's test a small capacitor. We see the capacitor charging and discharging as the voltage swings positive and then negative. This behavior is a function of frequency. As the frequency is reduced to near DC levels, the curve takes on the appearance of an open circuit. As the frequency is increased, the circuit begins to behave as if shorted. Thanks for watching.